Magic Collective, Emerald here, and let's play cards. All right, so we're gonna do a bolo for the 17th. Be on the lookout for. So energies that are going to be around you is what we're looking for, and I'm just going to pull out cards. I know the tricks are fun when they jump out, but let's just go with it. This is what I do before I come on camera anyways. Spirit drives the boat, not me, so all right. Now I can just move these out of the way, and you see how I pull those cards like no, no big. Nothing big to it. Ooh. There's just so many. All right. Let's see what the deal is for today. Let's see what today's message is, though. So. Oh, trust you got. There's like 30 of these. I, well, yeah, for one for every day. Ish. And that's, I'm a, an ordained minister. And I like to swear. And I like to tell you whatever spirit has to say whether it be good or bad a lot of people don't want to hear the bad stuff but i don't mind relaying the messages because love stories aren't always relevant every day so first card up is success is no accident it is hard work perseverance learning studying sacrifice and most of all love of what you are doing or learning to do so that's a great one trust your gut let's just read these earth and air dragon represents a perfect balance of heaven and earth stay balanced ground your visions manifest your hopes and dreams so i like it so what are you doing here projects success is no accident you're you're working hard Grounding yourself, creative visions here. What else? Don't dim to fit in. How are you dimming your light in order to fit in? See, that's what I was kind of just saying. I don't, I think when I first started recording, no, not I think. I'd see things and I would not say it because I don't want people not to like me, but I don't really, that really isn't the case because I don't care. I'm not for everyone. And your opinion of me does not change my opinion of me. Don't dim to fit in. Just be you. Tranquility, right? Wings. Trust all will turn out well. Everything will fall into place. Peace of mind and tranquility are soon restored. I don't know, somebody telling you you can't do something? Looks like you got your like nose to the grindstone here. What's this? Success is no accident. It's hard work and perseverance, learning, studying, sacrifice, and most of all, love of what you are doing or learning to do. What's this about for the 17th? A journey? Your journey? Specifically your journey? There's only one person in this card. Bless. Learning to to just, yeah, do you and not take in other people's opinions is hard to learn. The world, it's a whole new world. This journey is going to open up a whole new world. And it's almost like she's holding her light behind her as if to guide the rest of her crew here. And who knows who that is because we can't see them. So maybe you, you're a leader here, person watching, victory. One more, please. Well, what's this don't dim to fit in? Okay. I guess that makes more sense, right? <sighs> don't dim to fit in. Please like, share, and subscribe all those YouTube things that you do when you like a channel. 
the sun. Lots of creativity here. Plans for the spring, something that might be finished wrapping up in the spring. It's gonna take the rest of the winter to finish it up. And it's something completely different, a leg up. Receiving help, a charity. You chose not to dim to fit in and to be you, to shine bright here, to stand alone. This, I mean, again, she's the only one in this pool here, and the sun is shining on her. So, but again, being a leader, right? Mama Bear just persevering, really trudging through it, regeneration, it's something from the ground up. What the hell? Earth, air, dragon, represents a perfect balance of heaven and earth. Yin and yang, perfect balance. So you have the creativity and you have the drive. That's the perfect balance of your masculine and feminine energies, like yay. And tranquility, what is this tranquility? I'm gonna flip her over. She's an angel. There's a lot of wings out here already. Two pairs. Oh, orphaned. Trust all will turn out well. Everything will fall into place. Peace of mind and tranquility will soon be restored. A crisis. Maybe you feel like you've gone at this all alone. Something you've had to do alone. And yet you have orphaned and the sun. It's like the light and the dark. Heading towards the light, leaving the dark. I mean, this is pretty dark too. And this person's all alone. All right, let's get some tarot on it and see. Oh, I'm just pulling these back. What do I want to use? wizards up oh, and there's the hermit this journey card reminds me a bit of the hermit all right let's give these a quick shuffle chariot ten of swords wants to fall out here All right, Spirit, let's have it. What's, what are we supposed to be on the lookout for tomorrow? Sounds like sort of a pat on the back, although this up here, let's address that first. What is this? Trust all will turn out well. Everything will fall into place after an orphaning situation, after somebody feels left out or leaving somebody out in the cold. What is this? Reconciling you don't fit in. And that's okay right your opinion of me doesn't affect my opinion of me so peace of mind yikes yeah the world again and it just shot out on the world i am gonna actually just leave it there the world is your oyster like Just like snakes and trolls and fairies, I think using discernment's probably like. I guess we're gonna address this first since that's where the card flew out. So, can I have another one? It's like the world, the world, new cycles, ending cycles, three of swords, and the queen of cups. This is not a happy queen of cups. She's not even in the reverse. She's pouring out her cup. She is in water uh, over emotional ending a cycle with a queen of cups uh, some sort of water sign that is three of swords probably depressed uh, really 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 um, not stable let's just put it at that that's two world cards putting some space in between you and a Queen of Cups. 
for you. You have learned to heal. You have healed. It's part of this learning. Learning. You're going to learn something about a Queen of Cups also. All right. This is a bolo, so it's not all going to be all patting on the back here. Let's see. What else for this? What, what, can I go over here to this now? Trust all will turn out well, fall into place. Angel wings and orphan, you don't fit in. You don't fit in because you're different. We're all different, though, right? So everyone has clicks. Three of wands and the four of wands. Oh. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Hurry up and wait for an offer that you don't see coming because you have set yourself apart from something here. Another one. Thank you. Ten of Wands. Waiting. Something has been like a lot of work and I really feel like you've climbed up here all by yourself. This guy seems like he's pretty high up there too. He didn't get there by not going through a bunch of bullshit. And so here you are recognizing that you don't fit in. You're trying to find your, your, where you do fit in in your soul tribe and your people. And yet there's something that you're missing here. And so you're still waiting on it. Even though you've separated yourself from it because you know it's a burden, you're still waiting, actively waiting while you're working. I guess that's a good thing, right? Don't dim to fit in in the sun and a leg up, please. You got a leg up here, sun shining. You've learned you don't fit in, blah, 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 blah. Let's see. Why are these all relevant? Tower. Four wands. Woo! And the sun again. Can I have another one? Don't dim to fit in the devil. Hmm. And that is causing somebody a tower moment. They're watching you. Obviously, right? Because that's why we're watching tower to see who's watching us. The devil's watching you having a tower moment. Obsess somebody's obsessing over you having a tower moment that you're... Um, receiving help, that you're doing better than you were, that you are, that you have your sunny disposition back, that you're not dimming to fit in, that you, this person wanted you to obviously be somebody else. What's this yin and yang in the um, perfect balance here? Heaven and earth, earth angel. What's going on? Yin and yang, thank you. Perfect balance. Your visions. As you're, you're creating, manifesting your hopes and dreams here. You're putting some project into, you're making it real. It's not just thoughts. It's not, you're actually doing it. And that's eight of, eight of pentacles, eight of cups, seven of swords, seven of pentacles. So eight, eight, seven, seven, and then two kings. Plus three pairs. Mm. And I think it's because you, you did leave something behind, but you might have snuck away. You didn't stay for the follow. You just, like, grab your shit and run. Look real quick. Did I miss anything? No. Me and my bag were out. We already made a plan here. The Seven of Pentacles. You already you already invested someplace else. Just 
death and ending here to move forward. What's this eight of pentacles? You're working really hard. This yin yang energy to create heaven here on earth. A balance of heaven on earth. I think, no, I don't want all of those judgment. A balance of heaven on earth. And there's your spirit guides. And there's the owl, eight of wands. Eight, eight, again, except for it's a different one. Like, you're just making good decisions here. Eight of Wands, Nine of Cups, and it's really stressing out somebody. Uh, I think more than one somebody. But we talk about this on a daily, so let's keep going and see what's new. Why this reading is different from any other one. It's probably not. Here's the sun at the bottom of the deck again. I bet the horse comes out, breaking free. Blah, blah, blah. All right. Let's see. What do I want to use? The Intuit Oracle. All right, this is the Bolo for the 17th. It's only really good for 24 hours. <coughs> All right. <coughs> what did I just say? The horse is going to come out. <coughs> What's behind it? Soulmates. And a woman is poking out. Success is hard work, perseverance, learning, studying, sacrifice, and most of all, love of what you do and what you are learning to do. Faith, strong emotions, desire, some motivation here. Unbridled motivation, the devil. Capricorn could be relevant. King of Earth. Going with the devil since we already see him. In the winter, which is right now. Storm. Attitude is everything. Calm, cool, and collected. Although time alone seems very relevant too. This is a journey you were going on alone. Somebody can't come with you here. A deep soul connection. Communication. Who's this Queen of Cups down here, please? Thank you. A book. A mystery. Secrets. The Queen of Cups. No secrets. She's intelligent. Knowledge. Education. Hidden. Time. Uh, more water and unpleasant. What else is behind there? The Hierophant. And Can I get a... What's the Three of Swords? The sky, release, a reckoning, a harvest. No, no, no. No, there's no harvesting. Something unexpected. Something hitting that you don't, obviously you don't see yet. But I'm pretty sure you might have known it was coming, right? Because eventually that was this, this. Eventually this Queen of Cups here was going to melt down. Melt down. Why is the world out here twice, please? Collaboration, communication, more water. Cancer. It could be a cancer. And I think why the attitude is everything is because there's a storm brewing, sudden unexpected end. There's separation between you and this Cancer, this whatever, this Capricorn. I'm going to go with somebody is obsess obsessing about the separation. Maybe you moved. Somebody moved. Somebody, somebody doesn't like the distance. Maybe it's just COVID. Somebody can't get out and around. Mm -mm. Peace, 
kids. How many? They miss talking. They they need to talk. They they like talking to you. You're gonna hear about this three of swords. I don't know composure. Again, there's more water. Scorpio. They could be drinking. They need you to help them lift them out of negativity here. But is that your job? Is that your job? Woo! Miscommunication, giving lip service, blah, blah, blah. Hoarding, secretive, energetic. I think you can only do it energetically. You can't, um... You can't help this person because there's too much, yeah, light bulb, a breakthrough. Yeah, you cannot help this person from, um, whatever. You can't go over and visit them. What's this yin and yang up here? It's a new, that other queen, of, we're going to go back to it anyways. What is this yin and yang? Woman. You person watching Jupiter, the Wheel of Fortune, fulfillment, releasing things, putting space in between <sighs> you and people. You got some clarity here. There's been a lot of growth. You have grown quite a bit. The elephants. What else? The dog. Making stable changes, changes, focus, power. That's what this Eight of Pentacles looked like. And remaining optimistic about, I don't know, a, a dog. It could be a very supportive friend, a sibling, peer, or pet, faithful companion, or just loyalty and devotion, but I'm going with it's, you had to put some distance between you and some people. Established. It's already been established. You're very ambitious here. You have, <coughs> you don't, no more. You put distance between you and codependency, you and addictions, you and these, this over here, which is why the world is there twice. Mountains, you've climbed the mountain, a lot of mountains. What is this over here? Theoretically, the mama bear. Orphan, strong. When things are breaking down, you remain calm, cool, and collective. You knew that you know that tranquility will be restored. It's just a matter of time, right? Time, karma, cycles of the universe. So whatever this is over here that you um, that you know is gonna come back around that you're actively like waiting for. See, focus. Like you might have be asking, calling for karma, literally asking for it. It could be for um, with a, a company that you work for. It says boss, CEO, judge. Mama, beer, it could be for with a bunch of whatever. But you're waiting for this because it's hangman. You know what's going to come back around. So that's still waiting. Still waiting you know, because these, somebody has free will. But rest assured, whatever's yours, you know, karma in the universe, not everything happens in your time. It happens in divine time or our time. Not great saying. Divine timing. Thanks, universe. All right, don't dim to fit in. This is a completely different story over here. Use tact and diplomacy again, but although this is a um, make a detour, like warning. Why is this a warning with this Leo here, this Queen of Fire? Why is this a warning, please?
the Storks and the Queen of Earth, or the Hierophant. Ooh, there's been a change. Yikes. It's complicated. This sounds like it's going to be third party. It could be dealing with Leo down here. Two women and a man. And what did I say? Third party. I split it open. And then here's a ring. Developing over time here. Someone else. A rival. Now we're talking. So person watching. Two women, one man. Put yourself where you want. This woman, what? Divine intervention. Something's a pattern. Ooh. A romance. This has to do... Oh, fuck a duck, man. They just jumped out. Somebody is persistent here, a woman. Something spontaneous is going to happen. Challenge the status quo. Something's breaking down here. And the fox, man. Developing over time. Somebody's losing their fucking mind. Communication. Something about paperwork. Um, uh, paperwork again. And the snake. Toxic. What? And the Libra wants to fly out. Oh, and it did. A man. King of Swords character. That is two men and one woman. I'm not really sure where we're going here. That's a lot of people. Rivals. Tower, another tower. Tower on a tower. Abuse. Um, I'm going to go with... And there's the Empress. Fuck. Virgo wants to poke out an, old, um, an older Virgo. Problem solver. Uh, somebody is clever. They think they're clever. Woo! All right, whatever. Something's a pattern here or something. How much time we got? 28 minutes. This is a lot of people here. I'm picking this up. It's everything but the um, lighthouse. Tower come out twice. Drinking came out. Let's, um. Come over here, please. Let's get this other deck out here. Matra. What is it? Storytelling cards. I don't really know most of the names of the decks, but these are both on the back, so super helpful. All right, and that card that I just picked up was the soul. What is going on here? Don't dim to fit in with the tower and the devil and a leg up. Oh, spirit. What's going on down here? Suspected of a crime. Domestic violence. Insurance. Bribes. A symbol. Terrible. Don't dim to fit in. Initials? How are you dimming to fit in? A cult tattoo Freemason. Hmm. The signs and symbols, indecent exposure here, domestic violence, warning, 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 warning. There's a couple people down here in this section. 
pull off a heist. Mira, I already had the symbol. It looks like this on, but it's not. Leo, I just put the symbol right next to the sun and talked about it. A spy, who am I? Ready for a party. Narcissism, use tact and diplomacy. Win the heart. Pull off a heist. This has diamonds on it, and we saw the diamond earlier. Marriage, marriage proposal. Uh, I'm pretty sure that somebody is not digging your forward movement or somebody else's forward movement that is concerning you, person watching. Your leg up is like their demise. You, you, you stole their person. I don't know. That's like what it looks like. What is this? Insane person. Oh, this is great. Here we go. Here we go. Warning. 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 Suspected of a crime. Looney Tunes. Yeah, somebody is not like, they're like, who am I without my person? Who am I without the going crazy Looney Tunes celebrity? Stalker. Who am I without you? This person is watching you, like really watching you. They could work in a hospital or with old people and just saw the wheelchair. It drives them crazy to see you like doing well and being adored is what I heard. Nightmares, yeah, as fucking they can't sleep. A psychopath, illness, bad memories, predators, horror, they're horrified, it stresses them out, a lunatic. Maybe you left this person because they are a lunatic. Rats, right? I'm not taking that whole other pile. End up with a big. Uh -oh. I mean, a rat's a rat. An infestation, a low life, like spread disease here. Gnarring. This person could be chewing out their nails. Well, oh. in denial about something. They want to negotiate another go around, but you've already moved on. Whatever this is, whomever this outsider is that's watching, an alcoholic, in debt, addictions, somebody is behaving very foolishly here. There's already been a divorce, like they're in denial, negotiation. This already says a divorce and there's already been an engagement. Camera again. Why is the devil here? Well, criminal and best friends. Watch who you talk to, watch who you tell you things to, whatever, concerning whatever this is over here, this crazy person. We have been talking about a femme fatale, so Something is criminal. A hitman. A repeat offender. Somebody behaves the same way all the time. It's like not a surprise. Convict. I keep seeing twins. I see twins up here and I'm not really sure. Maybe you got twins. Soulmate. Maybe you think this is your twin flame. Ra, ra, ra. but childhood this person could have been in your life for a really 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 long time and maybe that's why they're fucking losing their mind explosion they're explosive they've always been explosive Ooh, again with the yeah crown they don't they don't like this 
I don't like that. Somebody stole their crown. They want their crown back. Collateral damage. Monarchy. Yeah. And who is this character here? Let me, let's get. That's not them. But this is. Who is this person that's losing it? No, that's a, that's like a fucking handful of people. Just to sign it to you, I know. Aries, maybe? No, Pisces and Aries. Virgo. Yeah, Virgo. Pisces, Aries, Virgo. Could always be more signs. Depending on whatever, who's watching, or whether you resonate with your moon sign, your sun sign, your rising sign. I know a lot of people that resonate more with their moon sign than they do with their sun sign. Just saying. Explosive. So what's this person over here? This queen of cups with his distance here. And I think they're jealous of you, family. History, family history. Uh-oh. Where are we going with... Jeez Louise. Where are we going with that? Extended family. Maybe that's what this person is. It's like extended family. But again with the domestic abuse here. Yeah, not to... Backstory, true story. What? Ugh. Let's see. Success. <coughs> hmm. A lawyer. <coughs> <coughs> Heritage, extended family, what is going on here? Kidnapping, oh, here we go. A secret location, and the gravestone just flew out. Again, this says family history on it again. Family history, family history, a backstory here. Somebody's looking at pictures home movies envy but why is the world here twice thank you memory yeah somebody is a child had to go there had to go there what's up here with this learning and studying what is that business up there a library course. You've probably read quite a book. Maybe wrote a book. Maybe somebody wanted you to be a spinster. A virus. A cultist. D DNA. Huh? Archives? Anonymous threat. I don't know. That fucking says kidnapping, and this says kidnapping down here, so... What's this child here for? Robot? Uh, yeah, automation, like, um, brainwashing, sort of, robot, child. Ah, oh, here's the spacecraft. Something with the government. Time. 
time in love, faith, a deep soul connection. More memories and history. Are you even talking to this person yet? What is going on here? There's like two worlds between you. Stop by the police in a restaurant. Underage. Family dinner, fine wine. Theater, whoops. An understudy, uh-oh. Criminal organization. Looks like, um, let me, pre-science, like, like DNA, like mother, like daughter, like father, like son type shit. Kids will be kids. And somebody's not happy about it. Uh, smuggling under age. I don't know, maybe somebody went out for eat and got pulled over by the cops. A teenager. Maybe they had pot or something in their car. Societal upheaval. It causes like a big, <clears throat> um, a big deal. Pre-science and estimated the gas like you knew this was going to happen. You just sit back and wait. Put some distance in between it. Heal from broken heart. Whatever. But now this person wants something from you. Well, they want a bedroom maybe. Or maybe they're sleeping at the police station. They might call you from the police station. From an anonymous phone number. An arraignment. Mourning and murder. Broken hearted and hatred. Fingerprints. Motive here. Win the battle. Tactics. Sounds like kid shit. Sounds like kids being kids. And somebody got in trouble. And it's all the other parents' fault or some some story like that. Weird atmospheres, psychic vision, buried secrets, demons. Oh man, this I'm, I'm saying demons, and then I pull out demon. This child having a hard time. Or this family is having a hard time drug abuse with this so, with this child. Glass tower people that live in glass towers shouldn't throw stones. Also seems relevant. Villain. Antagonist, right? Don't don't poke the bear. Don't make problems where they aren't any. Warrior. Yeah, threats, somebody's a threat here. They might be a threat to themselves. And it says hospital. Homing pigeon. Bird's eye view, uh, somebody, store. Import, export. On vacation, exploration. This is the same soul again. Spiritualism, meditate. Change the story. Editor, corruption. Get away with a crime, yeah, no more. Like, family squabble stuff and lies and bullshit. Teacher, you were taught wrong. You, you learned wrong. You heard wrong. You whatever. 
You believe the hype, you drank the punch, somebody drank the punch, and then we literally drank the punch. And someone else said, you know, if you behave like that, everyone's gonna drink the punch and there's gonna be problems. High Priestess says, oh no, you don't know what you're talking about. Five of Swords. Okay, says the High Priestess, but she goes on her way doing what she's good at, right? Being the hermit, learning. High Priestess, go do your thing, right? Learn, create, build, rebuild, and then bam, your victory is somebody else's tower moment. I told you so, Five of Swords. I told you this would happen. I told you, I told you, I told you. Seven is, um, it's not, it's the chariot. Four of pentacles and justice. Karma. And here you go. You held back instead of pulling together and doing the right thing here. You said no, a person, this, whoever this is. The high priest has said, this is going to happen. This other person said, no, it's not. I have it all under control. And guess what? That shit happens. And here comes karma. Because people are acting all out of control. Like they're possessed and shit. I don't know, you know. Eight of cups, yeah. The chain, a complete change in directions. Two of pentacles. There's a need to balance out the situation. Death. The devil and death are on either side of the high priestess. I told you this would come to an end. I told you it would end badly. I told you, I told you, I told you. Soulmate shit. King of swords. I fucking told you. Judgment. Again. I told you. And if you didn't hear me, I told you. Yeah. Right? Knight of cups. I know, it's immature, isn't it, right? But whatever. Immature to say I told you so, but when I told you so, you should have listened. Uh, the Ten of Pentacles and the Nine of Wands, the Six of Cups, Temperance. That those are two Sagittarius cards. This, you could have told the Sagittarius so, and then Six of Swords. You moved to Karma Waters, which. Left you in purgatory, but you healed from that. Four of Swords, Eight of Swords to the Four of Swords. Queen of Cups, you regain balance. Like, way to go. What's this orphaned over here, real quick? A choice. Two of Wands, Three of Wands. Nine of Pentacles, to be single, to be abundant, to be independent, to go at things all on your own. Collect your King Cups to make a plan to become stable. One more. Nine of Cups and get your wish fulfillment. Nine of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, stability, Emotional stability, you're doing the right thing with the higher fit and judgment, making the right judgments, you're happy, blah, 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 great, wonderful. What you had to work at, at over here, building earth and five of pentacles and the queen of wands. Oh, here we go. That's like connected to this shit down here. It's like they're separated a little bit. Like there's this separation over here. That's that. I think it's connected to this shit over here. And then in between you have, you know, great things, yin and yang, heaven and earth. Somebody is very jealous about that. They don't like it. And that's this down here. That's like two divorces and other shit. Right? Two divorces. Is that what? Psychic abilities. Working on this stack here. Oh no, that is a stack. What does it say? Sometimes you're wrong, and I told you so. Told you you were wrong. You are your worst 
enemy take a step back yeah this person needs to take a step back they create they they created a problem that is ginormous and you universal laws karma you told them they told you so you cannot behave this way and 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 expect to move forward your ex is relevant that's next situation was this one over here then is that different mm -hmm. try me i dare you well i'd be careful with this one i told you so on that one too Oh, God. Dark magic and right around the corner. Watch out. I feel like this is like a woman scorned over here. Doesn't matter. They're both angry. Everyone's angry. There's lies. This one is actively like wanting to dark magic. The queen of wands. Your ex is relevant again. So two exes here. All because you are happy and moved on somebody was in complete denial about that you could even move on or i don't know get your own own things build your own life get a new home i think somebody thought you just like couldn't survive without them ever never and that if you did leave them you would like i don't know crawl into a bottle or some sort of drugs, find something, just some crawl into a hole and die. But that didn't happen, and so people are having meltdowns, and karma is being delivered. So, real quick, what, should, what do we want to leave you with here? Trust your gut, communication, listen and speak with grace. Yeah, listen and speak with grace. Use tact and diplomacy. Listen to learn, not to respond. A realization, yeah, somebody has figured out the answers that, that is different. Something's not what it seems. Assertiveness. Oh. Temperance. Somebody's had a realization and they're ready to communicate and break the silence. It's here upside down. Although they're afraid that you're not going to accept them. I think they're really beating themselves up. But they 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 know their true feelings. Somebody knows their true feelings and they want to reach out. After an ending. All right, 53 minutes is like far too long, I suppose. Devotion. All right, guys. Temperance. I don't even know where that just fell out from. I could have sworn I was just looking at devotion. Oh, because I did that. Oh, I don't even know. Sorry, guys. I'm just being a little bit whiny. Something is dead and over, and, 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 and it's not. But I think you know that, poverty, orphan. You were waiting, like I said, for the, the whatever you told somebody so to happen. And now you're going to be the strength. Sometimes you're right. You told somebody something was going to happen. Told you so. I love you, spirit. You're so great. All right, guys. Until next time. Bye.